Hello, my name is Garx82, and welcome back to my Tech New Horizon series. I'm just kind of taking a look here at what I want to get done, and I think, well, first we're going to sleep. Um, just noticed like nothing was really spawning, and it's been dark for quite a while. Maybe they're not showing up on my... That was weird. Oh, there's, yeah. Oh, hello. Okay, that was weird. They like blended me for a second. All right. Anyway, um, I want to get a dolly so I can transport 16 buckets of lava. Um, I need to repair this actually. Let's see. It repairs 5:30. Yeah, it's probably. Would have been more efficient to wait till it goes down a bit, but I don't really care. Um, okay, so one of the other things I want to do, there's a few things I want to get done. I want to expand my tinkers. So I have a couple seared bricks here. But I would like to, I'm going to put this away. I want to make some gears so I can make a hopper. Now I think there is actually a quest for automating. Bit of a weird quest, to be honest. Are the multi-block holes this automation? Like you can automate it, and then if you craft a lot and place it under the faucet, it'll flow inside the pipe. Yeah, I don't. Maybe I don't really know why it's asking for a large bronze pipe. Yeah, I'm not entirely sure why. That's the thing for the, like, why is that? Um, I mean, I get, like, I know you're, it's, that's how you get it to the things, but, like, why a large bronze? I don't know. For the quest, that's what I mean. Like, I know you can use it. All right. So, but yeah, this thing is asking for two, two hoppers here. All right, so if we look at the hopper recipe, I might as well just do this one, I guess. So give me, yeah, it gives me some clear glass and loop. Why not? Let me just go ahead and do it. Um, so I have plenty of this bronze. I need six. I can't wait till we get a better ratio. But I'm working towards it. That's kind of the reason I want to do this. All right, so there is the bronze plates for that. The other one, I need 10. Let's see, 10 plates would be 15, right? Yeah, that'd be five, five crafts, and there'll be 10. Okay. Oh, and that's... That was for the charcoal. Yep. <laughs> but we're not quite doing that yet. Uh, I don't know if I will. I mean, yeah, possibly. You fill it with wood and then you get charcoal out of it. Uh, not, I want to see. All right, so there's the bronze. We'll make the pipes. Hammer and wrench like that. So there's the large bonds pipe. I don't know if I'm going to use it right now, but might as well. I'll just throw it in there for now. Nope. Oh. So the ten plates and then the two iron gears. Now, if we look at the hopper, this is what it's doing. So. It's trying to do two of these, so two the templates and the gear. So if we are right, yeah, so here's the gear. If we look at the gear recipe, it is four plates and four uh, rods. Now the rods are one ingot each. So that's four ingots, and then these are six, so it's ten ingots. If we do it this recipe with our ratio of crafting right now, it is ten ingots. 
But if we do the alloy smelter recipe, we can do eight ingots. So we're already saved two ingots. So that's more efficient. And then eventually we can do an extruder, which is only four ingots. So right now, the most efficient way to get gears is to use the alloy smelter. And a lot of ingots here. So that's 16 iron. So we don't want to be using that <laughs> a lot, but we'll do that for now. I want the, uh, the recipe. All right, let me clear out this a little bit here. No, that's not there. That goes yep, in there. And I'm going to put my <laughs> shovel and axe in there, and then as soon as I walk out of the base, I will probably need them again, because that seems to always happen. I didn't put that in there. I need to expand this. What was the... Is that it? Like... Okay, I don't get that recipe. I'm just trying to see if there's any way I can get this back. Block cutting machine can get me plates. I can melt it down. All right, so this is not getting enough steam to complete that. So I'm just gonna disable that, let it kind of fill up with steam a bit. I wish you could see the, the internal tank, uh, but you can't. So I'm just gonna let that go for a little bit. And the reason is, these are not big enough. I could actually use that. Why don't I use that pipe I just got? I was going to expand that anyway. I'm going to need to. So what I'm going to do is I'm not going to use it to automate the smelter yet, but let's break that. Break that. Now what I'm going to do is that did it can't tell if it attached the X yeah the X's mean it attached that's right and then we'll do like that and then see there's no X's on the that one so there we go so I think if I have yeah, that should be, that should feed it more um, since the pipes are bigger. So it shouldn't have issues like that again. Obviously now I run out of steam, <laughs> it's going to have issues, but I think, I think for now that's good. Right? Yeah. All right. So there it goes. So there's my two iron gears, and then four chests. Why does it need four chests? All right, that's wrong, I think. It doesn't need four chests. Or two hoppers, right? Am I crazy? Yeah, it just needs the one chest for two hoppers, so it but, oh well. Um, oh, do I have any wood? Well, that's going to be an issue. Oh, I have some spruce wood right there. Yep, so I need 16. Okay, I need to go get wood. Let me go get some wood. All right, I chopped down some more wood. I'll take that, that should complete the quest. Yep, there it goes. And, oh, I need, wants me to craft 
four of these, so I'll probably use the the chests again, so it's not like it's definitely not the end of the world that it wants me to craft craft four. Oh, it probably wants four, so that's my that's right for auto automating the the smeltery. You have it auto like output into a a chest. Um. I mean, I guess I could actually automate the whole thing. Yeah, why don't I actually just automate it? I forgot that. Um, is it hammer and wrench? Wrench and hammer? Screwdriver? File. So why a file? Wouldn't like a screwdriver would be better to like put it together. Anyway, so there's that quest. Get loop bag and oh, that's actually nice. I kind of wanted you to move you over. Um, but I don't feel like breaking that right this second. Um, man, I got my bags are like so full again. I'm chopping down trees and all sorts. All right, so there's that, that, that. Okay. So basic automation of this is what it was saying. Um, Actually, oh, I didn't mean to jump down. Now we can't get out. <laughs> can I? Can I do this? Nope. Go. Oh, there we go. All right. So if we put our chest here, and I'm actually gonna break this. So I can get to this. So shift click on there, it should attach. It's just let's make sure it's yeah. Put it right. And then we'll put this on top. And then we can just hop her in to the controller, and then it's probably as the other chest would be like up top there. And then we can put how many? It was nine. I can't remember what it was. Seared stone. Three sixty. Oh, it's twenty. That's right. Yeah. So twenty-four. That's seventy. I need ten more to do. Four of them. I actually need more than that. I need six. So six times twenty, I need one hundred and twenty. I basically need like two stacks in there. Um. Let's try to like do math so I don't have my smeltery like all clogged up. Is that right? So there's four sixty four. Oh my goodness. So it's sixty four plus fifty six. Yeah. All right. So that's one hundred and twenty. Uh, but obviously we don't, we're not going to have enough lava for that. So let's go ahead and let's make this dolly. Now that we have the rubber, oops, let's make a dolly. Now it's going to be a pain in the eight trying to carry this back. So, so let's see. So I can get, yeah, just one ingot gets me 
few of those, so. File and I'm assuming the soft hammer. Does it need to be in the middle? Does it need to be the hard hammer? Yeah, okay, so the hard hammer. All right. So that's those two. Rods, easy to get. I have steel plates. So we might as well make... That's for the rods. Got those. Got, okay, so last we need minecart wheels. Okay, so I need four rings and two more rods. So two more rods. And then four rings. And then the ring is just another rod. All right. So just nine rods. Is that all I need? All right. So the three and then the two. And then I need the rings. That's a hammer and a file. I feel like that's that's like really easy to make. Once you get rubber, this is like super easy to make. So two rings and what is it? Screwdriver, wrench. There's the two wheels. So wrench in the middle. Two wheels, three rods, that's, there we go, and there is my dolly. So I just did a quest somewhere. We did a couple. So we got this hopper. We got a chocolate cake. Alright, so this is a quest to make item pipes. So that is cool. We can start transporting items around. Um, I don't have a huge need for that right this second, but we probably will. Alright, so there was a quest to make a dolly. And yeah, I actually completed it. So let me just complete. Oh, look at that. We get a bunch of barrels too. And item upgrades. Magic drawer. I have no idea what a magic drawer does. Is it just like another magic wood slab, magic wood planks, magic wood? It's just any log. It's nothing. I don't think it's anything. Yeah, all the other ones hold 64. Yeah, okay, so that's just a basic drawer. Um, Do I want three ones or one three? I guess we'll do that. I don't have really a need to upgrade those yet, but uh, I will not going to complain about that. And then the cake, I'm sure, just goes down on the ground. All right, so if we shift right click, we can move this. Uh, it looks like we do have slowness, yeah. It's not too terrible, though. I've seen ones where it's like, you can barely move, you're like, <laughs> it's terrible. But there we go, that's kind of what I wanted to do. So this is why I like the iron chest, you can place them next to each other. Alright, so I'm going to go down my, I forget which one it was, the redstone. And get a bunch of lava here. And unfortunately, I don't have a way to pipe it in yet. I don't think these will like auto output or anything. Um, but with 16 buckets, uh, that will be much easier. And I think these turn into glowstone. I remember. 
maybe not. Oh, you can extract two to get yeah glowstone dust. Low flower seed. What if they grow? Can I plant them? Totally just. Getting distracted here. Yeah, apparently they grow. All right. We'll see what happens when. Uh... Maybe it's over. But let me uh, get some lava and we will be back. Okay, I take that back. This is really slow. <laughs> um, I also put a pressure plate on my gates. I don't remember if I had that before. But. There we go. So that feels pretty good. Let me just sleep here. And I'm trying to think. Hmm, that's weird. I wonder if it like do I actually have it or is it just kind of bugged out? We shall see. Yeah, like, I did have it. It should wear off. It might have been messed up because I picked something up with a dolly. Yeah, so there we go. That's probably what it was. Like, yeah. Um, but with the... Taking damage with the lava, like going back and forth, picking up lava and putting in the tank, um, it's it's best to pick up a bucket of lava, get the fire resistance buff from the the gloves, and then you won't take any damage. But as soon as it's about to wear off, pick up another one and then hold it until you get the buff again. Um, that way you're not it's not like wearing off and you're taking damage going back and forth. Um, Wait, I just realized. So this is melting this down, no problem. But this isn't pouring. Right. So how do you... Like, how do you automate that without... Now that I'm just, like, randomly thinking, like, that's not going to stop. Is that maybe why I was saying to pour it into a pipe? I don't really know, actually. Um, doesn't it need a redstone signal? And I remember back in like a long time ago. I haven't used one in a long time, but I would use the redstone clock. Which red alloy plates? Yeah, I mean, I could make one if I really wanted to want to. I can make all this stuff. I don't have another quartz, though. Um, I just need to get it from the nether. But anyway, I'm just going to kind of let that uh, smelt down all this cobble, and we'll check back periodically and uh, keep giving it um, some lava if it need be. All right, moving on. Um, one of the things I wanted to, I need to do, if we're going to progress, is boost my steam production. And I think, I think I'm going to do Railcraft tanks or steam. What's that one I want to do? The boilers. So I can do a solid fuel boiler or a liquid fuel boiler. And the liquid fuel would actually probably it would probably run off creosote, wouldn't it? The question is, am I producing enough of it? Which is probably not. Um, but if we get, I'm just curious. Like, there is a quest for yeah, this one. Yeah, railcraft. Maybe I'll just try the smallest one, and we'll kind of see um, what kind of fuel 
it burns through how fast it burns through I'll just do a like a one by three maybe um, but might as well get going with crafting this so we need iron 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 bricks do I have any more bricks All right We need that is just you put it through the thing. Yeah, okay. So that is really easy. What is it like eight? Yeah. So we'll just unfire bricks and then throw it in the furnace here. Alright. Bronze fire thing is this is a little more involved basically just a lot of bronze so let's we need I think it's four of those and then I need a bunch of these don't I is it solid solid fueled let's take a look at the recipe I haven't even seen the recipe for this thing yeah. So four. Yeah, I need twelve. Um oh, I just must I had that one over there. So there's that, and then it was one in the middle. Plates on the corners. All right, there is that. Is this going to be used for anything else? Last file. Um, I'm like, is it worth keeping this for 20 episodes in a chest? I don't know. Dolly away. Can't remember why I was doing that. So I was going to smelt those down. For some reason, we'll just throw them in there. And eventually, it'll get smelted down when it's done with the cobble. All right, that's a little better. So we got that. Take our bricks, compress those down. Those are two bricks. Nice. So four iron plates. This needs seven. So eleven iron plates. This needs seven. Seven fourteen. I need eighteen iron plates. Eighteen iron plates would be nine crafts. Nine times three is twenty-seven. Luckily, this isn't too slow, but it's also not super fast either. All right. Put that away. All right, moving on. The solid fuel firebox. Oh, it's not getting you. Okay, so it's not making you build. The rest of it. Which one should I take? Iron. Six iron or three. Jelly sandwiches. I almost want to take the food. The bricks. And then I just have one random frame. Cauldron. Hammer. Oh, the furnace. Furnace was just this in cobble, right? No. What was the furnace again? Three. That was close. I 
That recipe doesn't really make sense, but I think it's to gate it. For the expert mode. What was it? That and a hammer? One of these days I'll remember. Wrench. And there's the four plates. That should be the quest. Yep. And then I can actually do that because there's no tools in it. So there is our solid fuel, solid fueled boiler box. And then these, we look at this, you can look at the dimensions one by one, two or three. Now the one by one is I'm pretty sure the one by one, yeah, the one by one is what goes on top of it. And these should auto output into the pipes. So we might as well just, I'm going to do three on top of it. So I don't remember the name of what goes on top. The Okay, so low pressure boiler tank or high pressure boiler tank. And one's iron, one's steel, basically. All right, so... I want three of these. Might as well just do, go ahead and do the steel because we can expand it later and I have plenty of steel for now. I'm going to need this mold which is kind of convenient. It had us crafted already. So let's see. So we need two ingots. It's three casings. Okay, so that's not bad at all, really. So two ingots gets three casings. So four steel, five, six. There's six steel each. Let's make sure we take that out. So. 12 each. Let's just double check that. I should just double check I have. I'm getting the right thing. I don't know why I wouldn't, but yeah. Alright, so we'll, that goes there. Then I need six screws. I don't think my file is going to last. It might. It's 400 each. So there's the six screws. Yeah, that actually wasn't too bad at all. And the low pressure does 10 millibucks per tick. This does 20 millibucks per tick. I think it burns through more fuel, but it produces double esteem, so might as well get that going early on. So there is those. And what goes in the middle? hammer. I kind of don't like that one tool because if you look at this right away you don't know which one it is. You have to wait for it to like change. I mean I could just go and <laughs> the easiest thing would just be to craft the thing because then I could use it. You can use it as both. Maybe we'll maybe we'll do that. All right but we'll do Can't reach. All right, that works, right? Formed. Is it only two above it? Oh, that's right. Of course. Duh. So, 
I was thinking you could just add whatever you want on top, but that's not how it works. It's a one by one by one or two by two. So if I want to do it too high, I have to have a base of two on the bottom. Or if I want to do it three, I have to do, I'll have to do, um, it'll have to be like that. And then I can expand it like that. So, uh, yeah, I think I'm, mm, yeah, oh, I have to put water in this, don't I? Of course, because if it's steel, but hey, I have water right here, so I don't know. Why I was thinking that was going to be an ordeal. I really wish this would produce more, though. I feel like if it's in a hot biome, it should be producing much. All right, so there's the water. I don't know how much we need. Let's just put eight in there. And see how this goes. So this will heat up. That's actually heating up pretty fast. Yeah, that heats up much faster than the other ones, doesn't it? It just depends how fast it burns. Coal coke. Alright, so once it hits 100, it'll start. Well, it should start producing steam. Yep, there it goes. So 20 mil buckets a tick. What does this produce? Coal boiler, 100, that's 12, I think that's 12, no, 6, 120 millibuckets a second, so divide by, so it's 6 millibuckets a tick, whereas this does... Twenty millibuckets, so it's twenty millibuckets per tick versus six millibuckets per tick, so it's much, much better here. And then I can just do that, and it should auto output. I think. I thought it did. Doesn't it auto output? Hmm. Okay, I'll have to like look that up. Because I thought these auto outputted, but it doesn't look like it's doing that. I could put it right here, <laughs> and then maybe that would pull in. Um, but anyway, I will have to look that up, or possibly try to connect it on the top. Oh, I think it needs to be above this. Um, I think that's what it was, maybe. Yeah, it only auto outputs when it's over halfway, I think. All right, but anyway, while that's heating up, um, I probably, I mean, it's kind of, it's not exactly going slow. It is burning through coal coke. Um, so I don't know how big I want to make this yet when I don't really have a really great supply of this, but I definitely need, yeah, but I'm going to be upgrading this eventually, especially to do uh, MP power. Okay, so there it goes. It gets to the point, and then, as we can see, it's like going up and then down. So this should jump really quick, or we should see, yep, there it goes, 800. All right, so yeah, that's right. So it does auto output, it just has to be halfway full. All right, but anyway, um, next episode, hopefully we will get, oh, I can, let me take, the, oh, you get both of them. I didn't realize you got both of them. All right, uh, in between episodes, I'm going to, um, I don't know. I'll have to figure this out, but hopefully next episode we will start working towards uh, getting into LV power. We got our wires here, red LA wires that we're going to need to do, our turbine, um, yeah, and then we'll go from there. I also need to find 
a tetrahedrite vein. I haven't done that yet. All right, but that's going to be it for this episode. So thanks for watching and have a good one.